Okay, so here's part <coughs> part B, question number two. Sorry for the coughing. Uh, the cost of a pack of chewing gum in, in a vending machine is 75 cents. The cost of a bottle of juice in the same machine is $1.25. Julia has $22 to spend on chewing gum and bottles of juice for her team, and she must buy seven packs of chewing gum. If B represents the number of bottles of juice, which inequality represents the maximum number of bottles that she can buy? And so those are the four choices. All right, well, these two choices don't even make sense. Okay, why not? Because B is the number of bottles, and 75 cents is the cost of the soda. Okay. Or the gum. Yeah. So, we could cross these off. Okay. So, and she only has $22. Right. So this choice doesn't make any sense. Why? Because it's great, it says greater than or equal to. Okay. So the only possible choice left is this one. Interesting. Okay. So should I click that choice? Yeah. All right, and highlight it in green again, which I think means it's right. All right. All right, you ready to go to the next one? Yep.